anyway, so yeah, we are trying something different tonight in closing the hangout to the regular participants. And I really didn't want to get into it until Edwina got here because she and Dawn are really are uh, the last people to join this session. But, you know, we've, we've talked about in our community rules of there being a, a cutoff point for coming into the session. Hi, Randy. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Um, but but really, we didn't talk about when that would happen, or maybe we did say when it would happen. Oh, Edwina joined the Hangout okay, video call. Good. good. I was just talking about you, so I was hoping you would get in. And um, and when we leave here today, please send me your email address so I can send the messages directly to you. Um, because I was just saying that we had talked in the past uh, in our community rules about having a cutoff date for coming into the reading circle each session um, because it is a little bit disruptive to the group when we've reached a certain stage in, in the book and new people come in. And so you, you made it in under the wire, Edwina. <laughs> <laughs> and we're glad we're, and we're glad to have you and Dawn and Desiree who uh, I think has come to at least one meeting in session three. Um, but we're going to cut it off here for the rest of the book, especially because this is such a, you know, it's a difficult book to read. The content is difficult. The style is not that easy, and we kind of have all struggled through it chapter by chapter. But we're at a we're at a point now where we're kind of we're kind of rolling with it, and and we've been at this for a long time. This session started on January twentieth, and it was initially scheduled to go until June second, and then we extended it. Uh, because I think of weather or technical dis difficulties until June 9th, and you know, and now we, we we're going to extend it another week. And really, I think all of us want to hurry up and get to the end of this book. <laughs> um, and uh, Randy is going to select a fiction piece or something more lighthearted for us to read next session because we are we're all going to need you know, some mental health uh, <laughs> recovery. So we don't want you taking us back to what happened in Chapter 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. <laughs> we are done with that. <laughs> so, um, um, because we do have a couple of member, uh, new members, um, Benita was going to talk a little bit about the community rules, and then you can take it after that, Georgette, okay? That's fine. Any questions about that or comments, concerns? Benita, okay. well, and you look lovely today, too. Oh, thank you, Michelle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm feeling good. I'm celebrating Gio's birthday. Yes. Happy <laughs> birthday, your dad. Thank yes. you. Thank you. <laughs> so, everyone, are you ready to get started? Now, let's go over the community agreements. I'll make it quick so we can get right into our uh, next question. We have a lot of material to cover. Hi, Edwina. Hi. How are you doing? Life is good in Benitaville. Mm -hmm. I'm fine, too. Thank you. Good. Okay, we'll get started. Um, these are our community agreements. Um, I, I think most of us uh, probably read them by now, and, uh, but then again, we've had a couple of changes, and it's been a, quite a while. So I'll just go over them quickly. Okay, if you have any questions or concerns, um, just feel free to um, let me know. Okay? And this is for all our participants. First, we'll start off with we have to read the current chapter and the notes. It's very important for us to be able to participate 
in a meaningful dialogue, we can only do that if we've read the current chapter and the notes. Um, be on time and plan to stay to the end. That's another uh, uh, thing that's very important, that we have to be here on time. We start out at 6.30, um, unless we know prior to, um, it can kind of throw on things. You know, give or take, you know, three, five minutes is fine, but we only have an hour and a half, and we always have so much to cover, and we have so much so much dialogue uh, between us. We'd like to try to um, use most of our time for that. Um, of course, Edwina was very good about that. You know your ticket to get into the uh, book club, our book circle, is to have your book. Yeah. And Edwina mm -hmm. came and brought her book up. There you go. So, <laughs> she did. <laughs> that's right. She had it. So, that, you know, of course, we're aware that we need to have our book, and that, that is the ticket to get in. And um, our goal is to encourage all members to actually read the current selection, as I said, so their comments would be directly related to our reading of material. Also, too, it's one mic. One person speaks at a time. I am the designated timekeeper. So we have approximately three minutes to uh, state our point. Um, at two and a half minutes, I will give a signal. And the signal will be time. The word time. So that way you know that you have 30 more seconds to finish up your point. However, since sometimes we have all these profound things to say, if you need more time at that point, please let me know. Okay. So, yes. I will. <laughs> well, see, I was trying to be cool about this, but it's not going to allow me to do that. Okay. Also, use use of the I first person reflective, I think, I feel, or me, myself, I, I believe, is uh, what we're using uh, to um, convey our uh, points. I just went over the time, so I won't repeat that. Once again, if you need more time, when I say time, it'll be at two and a half minutes. You know you have 30 seconds left. If you need more time, let us know. Step up. Or step back. Active participation in our reading uh, circle is very important. Please demonstrate uh, common courtesy. Um, it uplift one another if it's genuine and assist in community building, etc. Sharing and post related national uh, material to augment our reading and our meetings and on our G Plus community page. So if you have some interesting articles that relates to what we're reading, uh, please feel free to post those on our G page, okay, so that we can build a fabulous reading community. Next, limit profanity. Of course, no one uses profanity here, so we don't have to worry about that. <laughs> and, yes, we don't have to worry about profanity here. And um, you know, we care, you know, whatever, remember that we're on air, so let's think before we speak. <laughs> okay. Now, this is for our, our moderators and facilitators. Write the notes and questions. Notes should include at least three key points from each chapter and at least six open ended questions, which we have done. Remember, this form is not a formal classroom, lecture, or training experience. Your goal is elicit dialogue among those in the Hangout clearly related to the current reading. In other words, no preaching. Okay. okay. <laughs> See? Encourage participation, especially from anyone who is being quiet, and help members clarify or figure out what they're feeling and thinking if needed. And Michelle will do that. I'm not worried. And last, which is good, we get caught up. Last without, uh, for the moderators and facilitators, with a timekeeper, ensure, and we two will work together, uh, that our meeting is flowing in an orderly, timely fashion, and dialogue is focused on the questions in the group notes. And this is for the timekeeper, and I'll kind of go over that quite quickly, because the moderator and facilitators work with the timekeeper to keep things moving. 
Um, we already talked about it two and a half minutes. I'll say time. You know you have 30 seconds left. Three minutes is the point. If you need more time, let me know. Um, and that wraps it up for our community agreements. If anyone has any questions or, or concerns, or if you want to add anything to our agreement, please let us know. Feel free. And, and all of those um, community rules can be found on the G Plus community page. If you go down the left column, there's a, a, a section there called community rules. Um, there's also a, vid a video somewhere of that. So um, thank you, Danita. You're very welcome, Michelle.